a fellow has to keep busy. It is a part of life. That's why Barney Collins putters among his roses. Nice rose here. Won a few ribbons with him, but no big prizes. That's gold medal. There was a doctor, and his wife brought a, a dozen of these to the show a few years ago. You've never seen such a, nothing like it in your life. Maybe not, but he hasn't done too badly with his sunflowers. The seeds help feed the birds. And the squirrels that come visiting. And he does okay with his tomatoes. And this is called beefsteak. A different variety over there. Good success with tomatoes. I don't know why. I, I'm not that much of a gardener. Maybe not, but he perhaps <laughs> has the tallest tomato plant in the neighborhood. That is it. The one that stretches skyward. I've never had nothing like that. Few of us have. He planted a cherry tomato and propped it up. So this year I got a brace on the other side holding the rack up. You can see the rack, it's exactly nine feet. And the tomato plant doesn't stop there. It would have gone 12 feet or no. I cut it off twice at six feet. It makes a person think of a certain famous beanstalk. <laughs> I thought of the situation. It's not just tall, it also produces. There's some ripens way up there. It takes a lot of work to pick the top ones. That's all right. A fellow like Barney Collins has to keep busy. Ray Summers at large.